Hello, I am I'm Martinez. My name is Itzel, and I'll be having my next giveaway when I reach 500 subscribers. I will have questions during a live, and when I reach 450, I'll do the questions again in a premiere. Right now, let's see what palettes are up for grabs this go round. So be sure to share me out to help me get there. Be sure to give the video a thumbs up if you like it. Good evening, everyone. I am, I'm Martinez. My name is Itzel. It's a get ready with me. I'm so happy to be with you guys again. And we're going to use this palette again. But first, let me show you what my little gremlin did. I swear, she literally turns into a gremlin late at night. I can't wear her. She messed with this one and my Natasha Denona one, but luckily that one wasn't too bad. I was so sad. So you got to see it when I first used it. Um, and it looks so pretty. And now I'm just like, it looks like I used it a lot and I didn't. So, children, what are you going to do? Don't mind her. She's being so dramatic. She's crying and crying when she was in here. And now she's crying and crying that she's out there. Um, that's just how she is. She's never happy. Um, so I'm not really sure what I'm doing with my eye look. I need to do a few things. I need to do my brows. I need to put the primer for my eyes on tape. So we're going to do that. Um, what was I going to tell you guys? I feel like it was something important. Oh, it's not really important, but um, if you watched my last Get Ready With Me, I'm so sorry. Like, the first bit was, like, so, like, staticky slash echoey. Like, it was, like, so weird. I feel like it was because somebody, uh, he's right there, uh, was on my freaking cord for my mic. And I didn't really realize it at the time, so, yeah. Because I always test my sound and it sounded fine like before I filmed. But then he laid there and it just it changed everything. So sorry about that. Yeah, some things just happen. Um, unavoidable. Like I'm not going to kick him out. So hopefully he doesn't sit on my mic again. <laughs> it's like, which one's the long one? Here we go. But yeah. Like, stuff happens. Life with pets. What are you going to do? Um, yeah. And because he's here and, like, he sheds, I have, like, a nose itch again. So, yeah. But how have you been? I'm pretty good. I was going to have a family reunion, um, not until, like, October. But I don't think we're going to go anymore. Like, originally it was going to be on a Saturday, but when my cousin changed it now she pushed it to a sunday and like letting it bleed into monday and it's just like we don't live in the area we live three hours away and my kids have school like they will not be on break so yeah and it's not even like you know oh they're online still like no they're in person now so yeah it's, uh, it's, uh, definitely not gonna be doable, like, really, not when, like, everybody has to wake up super early Monday morning for work, and then it's like, what, you're gonna wake up at midnight? Wake everybody up at midnight to go, and honestly, that probably wouldn't even be early enough to leave, like, at 10 at night. Like, mm, no. And for some people, that still wouldn't work. So, you know, it's not happening too bad. I have a cousin that will be getting married. We don't know the date yet, but it's like, I'll see y'all then. <laughs> so, if you weren't invited, then oops. Um, I still have, like, his hair, like, tickling my nose. 
so bear with me. Mm. I think I look good enough. All right. I'm trying to get like a small amount because sometimes I feel like I get too much. Which is good. Like, you know, a little goes a long way. So, yeah. Sometimes it's like, um, did I get too much? Because it feels like it's never running out. Making sure I get it like really good and spread out because I think one time um I like had a crease and I didn't realize and then it was like really hard. Um Oh tape. I'm like I was about to start doing my shadows. Like no. No ma'am. Where's your head at? It's Monday morning, it's so hard. So as you're seeing this, I'm like a week away. From, you know, driving my kiddo to get her, um, her next x-ray done for her scoliosis. I wish us luck. By the time you're seeing this, it's already done. And hopefully it all went fine. Like, um, uh, driving, like, you know, to, like, the busy areas of Arizona is always hard for me. But there's ways where it's like I don't really have to get on, you know, the 101 or 202, so that's fine. Um, yep. Yeah. It's like diving with anxiety sucks. <laughs> but we do our best, and that's all you can ask for. Alright. There's like so many colors all meshed together. Mm. Let's try purpley. Alright. Spirit all over the lid. I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah. But I feel like sometimes, like, that's the most fun. Alright. Just, you know. Ow. That's not fun. I accidentally poked myself in the eye. But sometimes that happens too. So. Hopefully, you know, my little buddy won't bother us too much. He's sleeping on my, um ring light stand like he's using like one of the um the supports i guess you call it as a pillow so whatever makes him happy i guess um are you watching anything new or interesting um have you guys seen um the movie yours mine and ours um like you know has what was his name i can't remember his name his name but it was like had miranda cosgrove and like a bunch of other like actors and actresses like it came out like i don't know like 2005 or something like that um yeah, I didn't know the entire time. Like, I watched the movie, like, multiple times, and I really enjoyed it, and I thought it was really good. It was a remake. Not only was it a remake, but the original actress that played Helen was Lucille Ball. So, we found it on Amazon Prime, and we watched it, and honestly, it was really good. They had a few scenes where it's just like, yeah, that wouldn't be okay to put in um in a movie now because of how people are but she um she gave her child like a light spanking and um like uh i can't remember the husband's name 
Is it Hank? I can't remember. Um, but anyways. I'll have to look it up. I'll pop up the name. Um, but anyways, like, his character, like, you know, he had his children, like, make her, like, they were teenagers, make her drink. And they each spiked it. And she had... She had scotch and vodka and gin. <laughs> so, yeah. She, um... Yeah, she had, she had a night. But, yeah, like, the kids came around and it was, like, really sweet. And it was a lot like, you know, the remake. Um, and honestly, I liked it a lot. It was a lot of fun. It was, like, funny and goofy and just very sweet and heartwarming. Yeah, let's go with this brush. So, I liked it a lot. I wasn't sure how I was going to feel about it, but I figured I was going to like it because I honestly haven't seen anything from Lucia Ball that I didn't like. Like, it was... It was hard for me to get into, um, the Lucy show, and it's not that it wasn't good, um, it just, it was hard to watch it without seeing, like, Ricky in it, like, just so used to I Love Lucy, so that was hard, so it wasn't even about that it wasn't good, it was just an adjustment. Um, and, you know, I'm not the best with change, so that's all that was. It wasn't that it wasn't good. And one of the characters in the, um, yours, mine, and, yours, mine, <laughs> yours, mine, and ours, that came out in 1968, like, one of the actors looks so familiar, and I'm like, why does this guy look familiar? And I, like, I kind of knew, but then I had to look it up just to confirm, but it was, um, What's his name? Van? can't remember if it was Van Johnson or Vance Johnson. I think it was Van Johnson. But he was on I Love Lucy, like, in the Hollywood episodes. So I was like, ooh, that was so sweet to see them act together. Like, again. So, yeah. Mm. Like, I knew Lucy did movies as well as, like, TV shows and stuff. It's just, like, I hadn't seen any until now because, honestly, I didn't know where to find any of them. So, I really enjoyed it. And I enjoyed seeing, you know, just the movie that i seen before. Just, like, you know, the original and what it was, like, really, like, because I, I find that fun. I find it fun like seeing the differences and whatnot like you know they did that uh overboard movie again and honestly i like the original best like like the new one it was nice but i like the original and yeah so i don't know i saw the remake first for yours mine and ours so i don't know which one i like best but i do like lucy's version just because you know it's hard not to like anything lucille ball does because she's so funny no one can tell me otherwise she was so freaking funny mm. so we went in we went in with rosewood loyalty and now we're gonna go in with I think that's a journal. It's like really dark. Because we're just doing like a purpley look today, apparently. Mm. So let me know um, if you had already seen both of them or if you haven't. Let me know what you think. I believe they're both on Amazon Prime, so you can watch both of them. If you have Amazon Prime. And let me know your thoughts. Which one do you like better? Honestly, it's really hard for me. 
But I like Lucy's version a lot. Mm. I think I need to add a little bit more color just because, like, you know, with the hoods, it kind of goes down, like, quite a bit. Uh, living with headed eyes. I think it just sounds funny. But it's like reality. Like it looks good and then the hoods fall and it's not as good. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, maybe I should have had it go all the way. Wish me luck, cause like I can never get them the exact same. Hmm. This one still looks better to me. Better, so there's that. I like it. It's pretty. So there's that. All of my shades are crushed in here. Like, all my <laughs> I think I'll do Nopa. Alright. It's daring, but I like it. this one in? Yes. So, let me know. Are there any movie suggestions you have, like, on Prime, on Netflix, um, Paramount, um, HBO Max, or, sorry, Max. Let me know always open to new ones i really want to watch the beekeeper on prime so it's one of those action movies with jason statham and i know a lot of them are similar but honestly i like his movies a lot so i want to try that one out and just see what i think of it because my mom was like it's so good so i just want to see if i agree because a lot of times i do like the same thing not always, but I want to have my own opinion about it. Hopefully, by the time you're seeing this, I already um seen it. So just check back with me. <laughs> oh, so I forgot to tell you. As you're seeing this, um, it was my kid's first day of school. So let's hope. It went well. Like, for my older ones, I know it's hard, like, getting in front of everybody because, like, middle school and high school and stuff, like, they make you introduce yourself to everyone. So, doing that, like, six or seven times, depending on how many classes you have, because honestly, I don't know anymore. 
Stockholm. It could be a lot. But, like, when I was that age, like, I went from 6th grade and 6th grade, we were still, like, it was, like, still, like, elementary school, like, you didn't switch classes, so I was very excited for middle school to switch classes and to meet different people. You know what they did? Um, and they did something similar in high school. Going in with... Nova almost went in with the wrong shade. Um, they had us travel in packs. Like, yeah, whoever was in your first period was in your second and your third and your fourth, like, all together. So, whoever you saw in your first class you saw them all day so it was basically like traveling with your class you didn't even get new classmates so yeah I was pretty frustrated with that not gonna lie because the whole part about you know middle school or not even middle school like junior high like seventh and eighth grade was going to different classes getting new kids you tell me I have to travel with the same pack of people. I was not happy one bit. I stuck with the same group all year round. So, yeah. And some people ended up getting switched because they were accidentally with our, um, class so around the first week they got switched to their correct group because they had like maybe one or two classes with us but majority with the other group so they're like no you belong with the other group so that was even more frustrating like really you can't just let them be like for real so yep i was pretty annoyed at that but with my girls i don't think that's how it's gonna be uh, i'm filming this ahead so i think they get new people and that's nice that they don't have to travel in packs because I was so frustrated um it was very similar in mm, let's just remove it it was very similar in high school now with that my first year they called it a block schedule only had four classes so you were in your classes um like an hour and a half or something like that so four classes hour and a half and you also got a lunch i think the lunch was that long or maybe the lunch wasn't that long maybe the lunch was 45 minutes i'm not sure oh wait no yeah it was like 45 minutes 45 or 50 minutes i don't really remember mm, let me just go in with the dark shade i'm gonna go in with journal um so Ooh, I see what I did here. This one. It's like filled in more than that one. Oops. Do you want to try to fix it? It still looks pretty. We'll see. Um, anyways. So, um, the people that had a different schedule than me they would have first period have second period then go to lunch but with mine you had first period you had second period and then you went to your third and in the middle you'd go to lunch hmm. i kind of want to do it so yeah it was so interesting and one time a girl well not a girl two girls two girls from my class um oopsies yeah two girls from my class um they got into a fight 
complaint after class. Um, it was like during lunch. Um, so whenever we went back to class, <laughs> the teacher was very confused as to why they weren't there and we had to explain that they got in a fight like we knew it was going to happen because one of the girls um she uh she wasn't wearing makeup and i guess like she always wore makeup before and Someone told her, oh, you look so pretty without makeup, and then the girl laughed, so they got in a fight. Um, yeah. And the girl that laughed, she was, like, the person that always got into fights, and people always um, picked on her and stuff, but I feel like it's just because she ran her mouth all the time, and she never fought back. Um, I ran my mouth too, but, um, people were scared of me, friends. So. <laughs> yeah. And they weren't sure if I could fight or not, so I didn't have to deal with, like, anything. I me, mean, it wasn't even about trying to run my mouth. It's just, like, I'm kind of blunt, so I just say stuff without really thinking about it. And it's not, like, trying to offend anybody. It's just whatever. I'm on mine. Um, and maybe by the time you're seeing this, we're working on actually seeing if I have anything. Because that was, like, the plan was to diagnose me. Um... But it kind of changed, you know, with my uh, daughter's diagnosis. Mine kind of got swept under the rug, so there's that. I cannot get rid of that dang line. Oh well, whatever. I don't think it's that noticeable from afar. I like it. The line from the tape is bothering me a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. Like, can you just, can you just blend, please? Yeah. Can you do that? No. <laughs> oh well. Stuff happens. So for the most part, it looks good. Got those colors. Let's go in with cloud. I think I used cloud before. I don't remember. I'm pretty sure. Oh well. Stuff happens. I like it. I'm not that line. <laughs> You're never gonna hear the end of that. But let's do the lippy. I got brushes everywhere. So I didn't use these two, so I'll put them to the side. Mm. I haven't used this lip liner in forever. I'm gonna try this one again. Oh, yeah. Did you guys watch the um, Get Ready With Me on the 18th of July? If you haven't, check it out. Watch it all the way through. Trust me, you're not going to want to miss it. And keep an eye on my number. Remember, 500 subscriber giveaway when I hit um, 
that milestone. Well, not right then, because, um, you know, i got to stay there, but, you know, I'll talk about it, like, you know, if not in videos, because I have, like, my videos up to date, like, you know, through the first week of August, which, like, you know, that's when you're seeing this, but by the time you're seeing this, I probably have more done, so, yeah, we shall see. I'm hoping for August, but if I don't hit August, maybe September, we'll see. It's like so nude, I can barely see it. <laughs> so, maybe that's a good thing. Hello, nobody wants to see your booty. Sorry about him. You know how he is. Alright. Let's get this done. And then we can finish the look. What do you think? I like it. It's so neutrally for the lip. Well, the eyes <laughs> are like a pal. So, let's be back and then you can tell me what you think of the final look. Alright, I'm back. What do you think? I like it a lot. I think it's very pretty. Remember, not in any order. So from the Ofer palette, I use the bronzer, the blush, and this light ivory shade for my highlight. For the palette, top shade is Rosewood. Just underneath that is Loyalty, the darkest matte is Journal. Under that is nova and that's like on the lid and then the um inner corner is that light shade that's cloud what do you think i think i did really good all right remember i said this already not in any order so this lip liner this gloss from ColourPop. Sorry about hitting the mic. It wouldn't be me if I didn't hit the mic. So, foundation from Ofra. Powder. Setting spray from Too Faced. Right, I'm like, I'm missing some stuff. Here it is. The Too Faced bronzing stuck. My kit, um, <laughs> not my concealer. My primer. It's because I was looking at my concealer. So, I mixed these, the e.l.f. and the Yinza, to color correct. Then my concealer. The glitter Primer from NYX, the Fair Eyeshadow Primer, I Method Beauty Liners, now I didn't do a wing, I didn't use a stamp, I just used the liner just to line it, um, Wonder Beauty Brow Gel, I'm almost out of that. A way brow pencil mascara and I think that's everything that I used I mean I use tape and brushes but other than that I think that's everything for my face so let me know what you think of the finished look 
um let me know if you're watching anything any movies any shows and drop your suggestions oh so i almost forgot um this month i think all of this month will be like my last um um videos for my favorites fridays for the my favorite shows series and then we're gonna hit the Disney series, we're going to start the Disney series in September. So, drop your questions. Whatever questions that you have, drop them. I'll let you know the questions that I have right now that I'm doing for my um, my favorite shows. Because I want different questions. So, for my favorite shows, it's what I like about the show, favorite characters, least favorite characters, what I disliked about the show, and why I would recommend the show. So, for Disney, let me scroll down. I haven't pinned it yet, I don't think. Did I? Oh, I have it somewhere. Maybe it is pinned. I've so much stuff going on, like, I don't know. Mm. I know it's somewhere. It's like, I didn't erase it, did I? It's like, don't tell me I deleted my favorite Disney stuff. I'll find it. I will. Here we go. There it is. I need to pin it. Alright. So, I have three questions. What is your favorite line a character says? What is your favorite part of the show or movie? What memory does this show or movie make you think of? And those are my three so far. Well, at least two more. So drop your questions for like my Disney series. And it shows in movies. It's not just like like Disney movies that made it to theaters. It's like Disney originals also. So, there's that. Lots of fun stuff coming. And don't forget, this is Wild Web. I'm going to do another 25 days of Christmas, but in shorts. Because, yeah. Why not? It was fun and honestly helped me get a lot of subscribers. <laughs> so, there's that. And it helped me, like, you know... Do more shorts, and I probably enjoy putting all my shorts in between my videos. So remember, I have content coming out seven days a week. Yep, every single day of the week, I have content coming out. If you don't see a video, you'll see a short. So if they don't pop up for whatever reason, go look for them. I have shorts coming out four days out of the week. Bye. Have a great rest of your week, and I hope you have a fabulous weekend.